Well, we begin with breaking news. After a lot of confusion and back and forth, it is now confirmed the Hatch Road Bridge on the backside of Spokane South Hill is not reopening tomorrow after all. Early this afternoon, we did confirm with city leaders that the Hatch Road Bridge would reopen in the morning. However, in the last 15 minutes, the city has issued a correction, saying after a final inspection, there is still a stretch of that bridge that needs additional work. So. It will not reopen tomorrow after all. We are turning now to Krem 2's Nathan Hyun, who is live right now at Hatch Road, where that construction is still underway. Nathan? Yeah, Whitney, so we're here right now at Hatch Road Bridge, where just in the last half hour, we got an announcement that the bridge will not be ready, will be ready for tomorrow, and the city said that it will be ready next week. We just don't know what day yet. While the road was closed, there was no convenient detour for drivers, especially for drivers trying to get to the South Hill. It's a complete journey just to get there. Some drivers had had to add an extra half an hour to their commute. One driver is very excited for the long-awaited road opener. Well, I'm spending close to $100 a week driving around. Uh, it's a five-minute five minute, uh, vehicle commute to work, and on my bike, it's about an eight-minute ride, so... It's going to make it a lot nicer. John Byron lives right near the bridge. He is excited to see more people come through. Oh, I feel great for especially the people that live in Eagle Ridge. Uh, they've been cut off from the South Hill for, for a long time. Uh, I'm excited to see. We're excited to see them driving by again. <laughs> we kind of miss them. The bridge was not supposed to open until the end of the month, and some thought that the construction on the bridge would last past July. We said they're going to be opened up the next day or so. I'm very ecstatic over it. I, uh, I'm excited. I don't have to get up so early anymore. The bridge was originally closed since it shifted when heavy vehicles crossed it, and the new bridge is expected to handle heavy loads. The entire project cost $1.4 million. Yeah, and so, you know, today while I was here, construction workers were painting and cleaning up the site, and even though it has made significant progress, it's still not ready to be open tomorrow. Again, the city says it will be ready next week. We just don't know what day yet. Live in Spokane, Nathan Hun, Krem 2 News.